In 2024, the Russian Ministry of Defense is scheduled to start delivering serial production MiG-35 Fulcrum F to the Russian Air Force. These advanced fighter jets have not yet been deployed to the Ukrainian battlefield and will be deployed in due course. Russian experts say that Russia needs a MiG-35 fleet in anticipation of a large-scale conflict like the one in Ukraine today. As a medium-class fighter jet, the need for the MiG-35 is considered quite large, because usually in any air force, multi-role light fighter jets will account for more than two-thirds of the regular fighter fleet, while heavy-class fighter aircraft, Usually the number is one-third of the total strength of the fighter jets owned. Light fighter jet units are used to carry out most of their daily missions. On this basis, the production of MiG fighter jets will be revived by Moscow, even though in reality Russia is deploying more Su-27s and their derivatives. MiG-35 can track up to 30 targets and engage six targets simultaneously. The MiG-35 with a plus 9G gravity limitation can fly at a maximum speed of Mach 2.25 and an altitude of up to 65,000 feet. The aircraft is powered by two Klimov RD-33 MK afterburner turbofan engines. The MiG-35 fighter can track up to 30 targets and engage six targets simultaneously. The MiG-35 has been described by the US media as a plane with brain power. The MiG-35 fighter jet uses an active electronically scanned array ESA radar. This gave him a very strong advantage in fire control and target destruction. If used, the MiG-35 is expected to be a great success in the war against Ukraine. This fighter is well suited for direct targeting against tanks, ships and heavy artillery. This is because these fighter jets are armed with a combination of guided and unguided bombs, air-to-air -air missiles, air-to-ground missiles, and a very deadly 30mm cannon. 